welcome back to my channel my name is Jackie and today I'm here to do an unboxing for the April 2021 Owl Crate box so this is if you guys are not familiar with Owl Crate a monthly YA subscription box I can't speak today that was a new and newly released YA book along with other workers goodies every single month I have been a subscriber for a little over two and a half years it'll be three years in June which is crazy to believe and I have loved over the, all the boxes I've received and I cannot remember the theme off the top of my head of this month's box but it'll be here on the screen and you guys will find out in a second but without me rambling any further let's jump right in and get started okay starting off we have our monthly spoiler card so this month's thing is Ruthless Royals here is the artwork on the front of the spoiler card very very pretty this has everything that is inside the box on the back of it so i will be looking at it right now but we will refer to it as the video is on i'm so excited okay so the first thing i saw in the box was something i'm so excited about because i've been wanting something to be included like this in a box for a long time it is a phone case wallet it says history has its eyes on you which is inspired by hamilton which i love i love hamilton so much i'm so excited i saw the packaging it came in i'm like is this hamilton theme this better be hamilton theme i'm so excited about this and this was designed by lady chub letter gibson copy which is inspired by where dreams Descend, and this was designed by feeble grounds coffee it is cinnamon and hazelnut flavored coffee and this is a cute little packaging it came in so cute i'm personally not a huge coffee drinker i will have it every now and then but i might put this to good use with my mom or you know if i ever decide to drink it sounds good to me very very pretty we have a set of chopsticks designed by uh paperback bones inspired by these by up the light so here is the package they came in which is so pretty i love the flowers on it and the moon and open it up and here is what they look like i'm only gonna take one out but here it is if i can get it out oh my gosh very pretty i love the red and gold and it says a scarlet gang on it very pretty um uh, i've only used chopsticks a handful of times in my entire life but i might use these these are really really cool a card game called at Katera, I'm probably butchering that. I'm so sorry. This is also designed by Paperback Bones. Here is what it looks like. It's basically a card game based on books and for fiction loving friends to play. So this is my something I definitely am in the mood for. I like I love card games like this. I love the packaging. It's very cute with the books on it. So I definitely will use this a lot. We have a pillowcase, which I have been needing for a while. And it is inspired by Nevernight, which is one of my favorite books. Uh, it says, conquer your fear and conquer the world, which I love. Like, look how pretty this is. I love the roses. I literally have a pillow I'm sitting on right now. But I'm going to put this on because I think it's so cute because I love Nevernight. So pretty, and this was designed by KDP Letters. The book, which is Witches Steeped in Gold by Shannon Smart. I'm really hoping I'm saying that name correctly. I'm so sorry if I did not. Guys, I'm obsessed with this cover. This is so my aesthetic. I love the black and the gold. It, it, and the silver too. Like, oh my gosh, I love this. this. is like completely matches my room. Like, oh my gosh. So pretty, like all the way around. I am obsessed with this on the back it says en enemies bent on revenge on an unlikely alliance one which left standing so let's read more about what this is about so this is a jamaican inspired fantasy debut which featured two rival witches who enter a deadly alliance and to take down a common enemy this twisted cat and mouse game set in a richly imagined fantasy world will keep you on the edge of your seat the whole way through oh that's that's exciting like guys i'm already intrigued not just by the cover because like i i can't rave enough about this cover it's so damn pretty but that synopsis sounds like everything i love i love a good revenge plot so sign me up there's a couple things before i move on to the other stuff in the box but we first on the reverse side of the dust jacket we have some beautiful artwork like how pretty is this i love a good reversible dust jacket we also have a beautiful embossing on the back or the front of the book i should say like oh i'm obsessed and the spine mm, i'm obsessed with this guys as always this book came signed by the author hopefully you guys can see that on camera and it also came with a letter from the author and the last couple of things in the box are kind of teasers for next month's theme so the first thing we have is our owl crate newsletter which shows that everything was inside the box the original cover of the book was all pop of the picture right here because i'm also obsessed with this one and kind of a hint at next month's theme a little crossword puzzle for you guys to do and the instagram challenge for this month 
And we have a card telling us next month's theme, which is Expect the Unexpected. And it says every box will include an officially licensed Libre Dugo item from Out of French, which I've heard very good things about that company, so I'm very excited. So that's something to look forward to in next month's box. That is it for the unboxing, guys. Like, I am so impressed with this month's box, guys. This might be my favorite box I've ever received from Allocate. Like, this Hamilton card holder thing, like, really made the box for me because you guys know how much I love Hamilton. So, overall, like, everything in this month's box is amazing and I'm very excited to use it all. But if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. I post new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So make sure you subscribe to hit the notification bell to be notified for when I post a new video. And let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of this month's box. I would love to know. And as always, all of my social media links along with the link to Alcrate's website will be linked down below for you guys to check out if you haven't checked out those already. And with all that being said, I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you soon for another video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye!